Okay, YouTube. This is my Glock 30 and 45 caliber. And sorry, the lighting in here is a little, a little bad. This is not a voiceover, which is really nice. Um, I'm gonna switch it to macro lens here, as you can see. Uh, you have takedown leather lever on either side. Uh, you have the Glock safety on the trigger. It is a safe action and a trigger block. Um, this particular gun, as you see, it's empty again uh, in the magazine release right here. Okay, uh, this gun does have night sights on it. And let me switch back over. Okay. All right. Now, <clears throat> um, this is a good gun. It's my everyday carry. Um, it uh, weighs 26, I think, or 25.99 or something, basically 26 ounces. Um, its overall length is, um, I believe it's 6. 0.77 from from uh, the top down to the the bottom is four point something seven seven also I think um, once you throw the magazine in um, you have a little extra it's almost five inches from here to here um, <clears throat> and this is nice this actually has somewhere to put your pinky when you are holding the gun see um, Anyway, this this particular gun comes with a Picatinny rail. I don't put any lights on this. Uh, this, like I said, this is my everyday carry, uh, concealed carry. Uh, I sometimes use the Phobos paddle holster. Um, thing I don't like about these, uh, if I go into a metropolitan area or very crowded area, I will not wear this. I want to have something that has a some form of retention on it. This does not. I mean, it's obviously a, it's compression retention in it, but still. Oh, and then these can snap. I've already broken one of them, uh, and that's another thing. There's a video on here, I think, where somebody goes up and tries to disarm somebody that's wearing a Phobos holster. They just twist it right off, and the gun's theirs. Um, <clears throat> anyway, this gun. Sorry, I just kicked the camera. Um, this gun, the magazine has. Um, 10 in it, holds 10, capacity of 10, um, and it's 45, um, I use hollow points, you can see. Um, it, it, these guns, oh, and this has a plastic magazine with a metal insert, which I really like. Um, these guns, you know, you can take it to the range, shoot it all day, put, you know, 500, 600 rounds through it, dirty gun, never have a misfeed, never have um, a uh, stovepipe or anything like that. Um, this gun, I, I uh, shoot the same that I shoot my Glock 21 qualifications with. Um, a pretty accurate little gun. I, I mean, I mean, actually, uh, I think I shoot better with this, um, especially because it's a, a smaller barrel. Anyway. Some of the things that people will notice is that it is a little on the thicker side um, compared to like a, a Keltec or a Ruger um, in the nine millimeter. Of course, um, the <clears throat> you know this is what you get for a 45. You, you, that's the uh, thing you sacrifice is the width of it, um, and also it's a double it's double stack. You get 10 rounds. I mean, and then one in the chamber. I mean, it's 11 rounds of 45. Um, you know, that's a stop that's a round that's got um, you know, st stopability to it and um, I, I feel very comfortable knowing that I have a 45 with me um, <clears throat> some people don't like glocks because when you um, go to take it down again clear when you go to take it down uh, you got to pull the trigger <laughs> and you literally now I can do it here. There you go. You know, so you just have to make sure that you've checked it, make sure that you don't have a round in there. Uh, polymer. Uh, or 
middle. Here's your spring, it's a double spring and barrel. Um, get a good look at that. Uh, one of the things about this particular model it does have some uh, tapering um, on the ends. Um, <clears throat> I, I really like Glocks. Uh, you, it's, uh, it's a moderately priced gun. Um, it's not uh, high end like a Sig Sauer um, price wise. Uh, I think I bought this one for four sixty. Uh, got it on. Um, I got it on Gunbroker. Dot com. So if everybody's ever, f if you're familiar with that one, or if you haven't, you know, you really should uh, check out Gunbroker. Um, you know, you, you can, like I said, I mean, you can throw this in the mud, uh, throw it in the water, um, drop it on the floor. It's not going to go off uh, until you need it to go off when you pull the trigger. Um, but anyway, like I said, I, I carry this um, as an everyday carry um, when I'm not at work, obviously. Um, because I have another weapon that I carry when I'm at work. Uh, <clears throat> well, anyway, uh, if you have any questions, uh, comments, please post them. Um, like I said, I'm a I'm a Glock fan. So, anyway, thanks YouTube. Okay, YouTube. This is my. Glock 30 and 45 caliber and sorry the lighting in here is a little, a little bad this is not a voiceover which is really nice um, I'm going to switch to the macro lens here as you can see uh, you have take down leather lever on either side uh, you have the Glock safety on the trigger there's a safe action 